So if you've been watching the news, which I'm sure you have been, you know, somebody at the Oscars just got smacked. And, uh, you know, it's 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 those types of situations that we can get into in real estate. And so today we're going to talk about how tolerance and patience gets a better result. So when you are out there in the marketplace looking for homes, and it's tough right now, we get it, but if you can take and give yourself some patience and, and tolerate, you know, the house is coming on and off the market and, and it's just kind of slowing things down and, and making very calculated decisions rather than emotional decisions, then you can prevent yourself from a situation where you have to, you know, um, quote unquote, publicly apologize for, you know, making some decision that was just a spur of the moment thing because it's it was frustrating and and aggravating because it's very frustrating and aggravating right now in the marketplace to write a lot of offers. You know, you think you've crafted your best offer and it still doesn't get accepted. You've thrown in the escalation clause. You've waived the inspections. You've, you know, you've waived the, you know, appraisal just to get that one house. And I always tell all of my clients that the house that you're supposed to get will be the house that you get when it, when it's right. And so sometimes you just have to, you know, continue to throw a dart at the dartboard until you hit a bullseye, you know, because it's, it's just very, um, you know, um, you got to have that endurance in order to get the result that you want. And, um, you know, right now it used to be, you know, you could write an offer, maybe one or two offers in and you get the, get the house right now, you know, we're seeing houses, you know, um, getting, you know, 15 offers in some cases. And so you just got to be patient. You just got to have good endurance. You've got to don't make rash decisions. Don't go and spend money you don't have and you will get the home of your dreams. So I hope that was entertaining, helpful, you know, all the things. Just don't be going around slapping people, you know, because people will say things, and, you know, if you slap the wrong person, there could be consequences. So I'm JP Flewellen with the Titan Real Estate team at Real, and we'll catch you guys on the next video.